I think it, I think that might be a little slower than is the it? last one. I think it's a little slower than what you were just doing. Tell, yeah, okay. yeah I, I think like bump it up a couple BPM and it'll be the same. Okay. Well, I definitely feel like I learned a lot from from trying on the producer's hat. I've never produced for something that wasn't my own project, and so to keep that in mind while working on something that it it has nothing to do with me is actually really liberating. You can look at it objectively. It's totally be the same, it doesn't really matter. Okay, so let's um, let's come up with like a good, you want like a clean sound for that more or less, right? I thought that P did an awesome job. He knew that I had a pretty good idea of what this song was gonna be coming in, but it was those little touches, especially on some of the pedal board stuff, piano stuff, like just little things that he could add that, that I, I definitely wouldn't have done on my like own. There's like this, there's gonna be this area. In the Port St. Willow session was very, very smooth. It was actually very serene. Those guys are just super good friends. It just seemed really relaxed and really fun at the same time. Peter was the, the enabler and, and Nick was like the kid in the candy store. Um, just, yeah, just keep playing. You assess what a particular person sounds like and then you try and accentuate different aspects of their personality musically and as a person. And I know Nick really well and I know the things that will and won't work for him and what his strong suits are and how to bring those to the surface. I think it's a mentality I want to bring back to working on future Antlers recordings is to be able to occasionally pull back from that and look at a record objectively and think, does this sound like a record? A lot of times you can record things and it doesn't sound like a song. There's a, there's, there's a point where a song starts to sound like a song and it sound, starts to sound real. That's the point where you can listen to it objectively. And that's what I felt like I could do yesterday and that made it a really, really enjoyable experience.